Belfast, last time I was here was 2007. Patrick ATM. You've not given us no context, you've just swooped. Well, get in here, come on, let's come in a bit. Hello. Chaps, call your king, you're not even wearing socks. Well, that's, I suppose, because you're, you're down with a kid. No, no, I've got socks on there, pastel colours. Got the pastel oh, socks. I thought, he, so I thought he'd pulled the handbrake up on the sponsorship no. deal because Billy's getting more views, probably. Ready for it then, chap? Bit of you in it. It looks so good. Like the nuts, to be fair, he has, he has been harping on for a number of years about he wanted to get back and doing it. And now he is. I know. And we've just found out, I thought it was a 6,000 seat stadium, 12,000. First time he sold out, and do you know the difference? You, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We've done it again, Ed. Well, I wouldn't say We've done well. It again. I'd say again more here. He's the mastermind yeah, Ed, behind your fair, whole career, Ed. and anybody that actually Obviously. knows what they're on about knows that. Yeah, that's yeah. why I'm the team manager this weekend. I'm in for half the prize money. Ten percent you get. <laughs> Give me a second, I'm trying to select the appropriate weapon. Uh, watch where you step in, them snakes all around, you know they're connected. Uh. It's Thursday night, we've come to look at the track, flew in this afternoon, get signed on, get our passes, um, and then find out a little bit about how the show's gonna work. We've got a meeting at 7.30, but track looks mega. All the boys have done a great job with everything, the advertising, the banners, and both nights are sold out. So, well happy to be right in front of such a big crowd. Can't wait to get out there now and get amongst it all. Yeah, that's a little bit nervous, man. I've come to Belfast before I treat myself a new pair of shoes. I've got to walk a long way. Mate, you it's in your fringe up or something. You're, on my, you're my teammate now. We've done a poll on Instagram. Should he take them back? Which now I think is too late unless we get toothbrush on it when we get back. At the minute, it's 95% taken back, 5% keep them. A couple of people have said them. keep them for school on Monday. Another person says if you're out on your sir run around town, <laughs> keep them. That, they they're they're look just like normal track shoes. shoes. Yeah. This is generally so good. As far as Arena Cross goes, it's not tame by any means. Like, if it doesn't look big on camera, it's big. If you've made it through this far, the last <laughs> one's really gonna get you. <laughs> no, are you glad that you rode your Arena Cross track that you built? No, I've not rode it, have I? But this is- Was um, it a waste of money, can we agree? Yeah, waste of money and <laughs> what more so, more a waste of time and, and making a mess of the field and the drive. And Just, who, um, who told you all that? You did mention that before. <laughs> I'm a bit nervous now, I've seen it all to be honest. <laughs> well, we have up there. It's too peaky. Too peaky? <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. He says it's too steep and he wants a word with you. All right. <laughs> I don't know whether you was making it up to me or not about hitting a freestyle ramp, but if I would like to open a show up, that'd be quite cool. Maybe hit a couple of freestyle ramps, if I feel confident we might have it. Maybe write in the comments if you think I should hit a freestyle ramp. I'll just go for it tomorrow night. Well, straight that, that, out, follow him in. I'm, I'm confident walking the track. I am. I'm not sure what it'll be like when I get on the track tomorrow, but it, lo it, looks, it looks good. It's a bit, a bit more you? serious than what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I have my confidence was sky high because I've watched past arena crosses and I've gone step one, step up, double. Lovely, we got this. But I've seen Matey slap all the way through it on the old two straight 125, his GoPro footage. We've all probably watched the same video. All the way around, every lap. Through the finish line, no problem, he goes at me. But I, and I thought, I can do this thing. I can do that. Have you signed on and done it all right? Yeah. Matt's uh, given me permission, I can give him, if he pulls this off, Matt said I can give him one championship point. <laughs> <laughs> the mixture's here. Two and a half weeks. Yeah. Look how rich you are. Um, <laughs> got that as a present for Christmas. Who's your sponsors, Mick? Not Kex, they didn't give me nothing. I have to buy it all. Come here. Who's this? It's you. That's your brother. Oh, the bike. Warming up, Edward. I think everyone's as nervous as me. We're all in the same boat. We've all done no practice. And we're all a bit scared. Have you got, have you got any um, 36 mil films? What, you've, prepared, you've come prepared? 36 mil films. No, I'm joking. Bob's hooked me up. I need to go down a bit. Tommy going back, Patch. Bringing it back old school, Edward. It's alright, I'm quite excited, quite nervous. We've got a new sticker new as well. New sticker, whole show, mate. Thanks for those guys for coming on board. Put, can we put the link in here so they can go to whole show, mate? Yeah. Put the link in. They do everything, every brand, almost every brand of gear, enduro, motocross. This is okay. nice. What is that? You can take a punch now, look. <laughs> That's in case I whack the old fucking chest on the bars through the whoops in a minute. It's really starting to get real now, isn't it? <laughs> Thank you. 
Any good? Uh, yeah, he's happy. No. Well, I didn't do one triple, but I think once I get them, there was a lot of them jumping at that time. Hopefully it mellows out a bit and it makes it a little bit easier too, but overall mega. It's actually really fun in there. Left, right, no, down a bit. No That's arms, exactly just what same getting more, you're getting more, just stand there, you should just come stand behind you fucking, what's the name's for you? <laughs> That's what I'm going to use. That, that, is a, that is a proper good pout there. Oh, you <laughs> caught that. <laughs> Here's Elliot, that's straight off a ski slope. Straight in, ski <laughs> in. <laughs> Later on, we've got to go and talk about the t-shirt, cannot. Oh yeah, it'd be good, wouldn't it? I'm quite looking forward to that. Apparently I've got to come out with you. Yeah, it'd be good. Well, I can easily leave the boot on all day. Are you alright or not? Jump the triple head, done the triple. You found the key. Found the key on it? the way in and then just thought I'm having that. Yeah, we made we went one one little it? click on the suspension. Made a call to K-Tech, one click in, done the triple, but I didn't like the way it kicked me. How are you feeling out there, Ed? It's fun for me. Is it? Oh yeah. Have you witnessed a lot of good things or Booker, not? Booker nearly OTB. Booker went, almost went pole. Yeah, but the first session he was nearly over the bars. Yeah, I've Be nice, here. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. You're lot. asking if I've witnessed anything. Okay, yeah, go so on. So I've witnessed that. He saved it. I've witnessed Mel on the deck, Jake on the deck. Jake spoke to Jake. He's got chronic arm pump. How did I look? Good. What, you were quite proud of my performance? Do yeah. I look safe? Yeah, safe. Safe is key so far at round one, but we're enjoying it. We've had two practices now. We're going to go back to the hotel. How do you feel, Sean? Yeah. Good. You unlocked the triples or just lost the key like us? <laughs> I did unlock one, but I wasn't sure whether it hit it in second or third. And Fucking tripling all over the place now, mate. I see the old man do a triple, I thought I'd better have a go. <laughs> I didn't do the other one, though. You've done that first session? I know, and I bought it then. The one time I went a bit like that. Though. That's actually more fun. Yeah, it's just like the MX jump. Yeah. But I can't do more than one lap. I said to Ed, I cannot do more than one lap. I Chronic finished arm the lap. Pump. Finished the lap, I'm like, Ooh. Cheating, you. Look, he's so worried about what he scrubbed all the blood. What, what number scrub have you got? <laughs> Look at this. Uh, yeah, we're not You're not even out, fucking mate. racing competitively <laughs> anymore, you mate. You don't even want to know what gear I'm starting in. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's something you his, do. His head's all over the place. <laughs> he's trying to fry yours. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I come round, he's just in a little... <laughs> <laughs> You've got any tape for my ankle. I'm just getting tips from the past arena across champ. Champ, champ, Chatfield. Don't know what to do. No, you're doing good. We're going to play Charlie in the Chocolate Factory now. This is a giveaway for Armour Vision. Product, you've probably seen me using it on my Instagram. Brilliant product. Goes on your lens and then the water don't stick to it, the mud don't stick to it. This is a golden ticket. Any purchases made between now, when this vlog comes out, and three weeks time, you can win two VIP tickets to London Arena. There'll be something in one of the packets you buy and um, that will give you the free ticket. So it's like you buy it, in one of them is going to be the golden ticket and then you're going to get two VIP pass to London. So go buy this because not only can you win it, it's a brilliant product. Ed rates it very highly, I rate it highly and um, you won't be disappointed. Bruno! 
look at the inside track there, yeah, he's been on fire. Uh, he's going to start a different cross as well. He's not a couple of seasons. But a great issue right here, right now. He's had a score that's part of the fight going. Meanwhile, we've got his brother sitting. It is very tight between those two and then a little bit of a gap for the rest of the pack. All gone a bit wrong right here, right now. There's some block block covers. You can get wrapped up in the most. Oh, Ben Clayton somehow saved himself right there. Well, what is our fair share of realty skills? It's a usual green across Chad. What I mean by that? He's had on Chatfield, right? Back in 13. Has he made the move? Vision strips and the bollocks for the goggles. So if you want some of them, get them. Buy Keg's underwear as well. Right, shameless, shameless, but we'll take it. He said they are the best. There wasn't another word in there at all. Uh, mine was okay, smooth sailing. they will start, all starts at the beginning of the day, doesn't it? Mm. So far, so good, Ed. Hopefully, just smooth sails. Or they do say, a rough sea makes a good sailor. Is that what it says? Something like that. I've seen Caroli write it somewhere. I think he's even got a tattoo on him saying, rough seas make good sailors or something like that. I need you to tell me what the fuck happened. You're a heat winner. Wow. <laughs> I am riding the 250, not this one. I'm riding the 250 and so is Matt, but 250s. You're that? doing it for the 250? Anything can happen. I'll fucking do it. Why? How can you come back for four years in a race and go win? Oh, I was doing all right, everyone. Yeah, I was proud of that. The best bit's when you suck it off the top of your gum when it's all stuck. <laughs> Lit that off. I thought you were going to blow it through the hole then. Just come off it. Well, that's a nice snap on spanner gone in the peanut butter. How much is the peanut butter spreader? About um, 19 quid or something. Yeah, probably. It's a 10 mil. <laughs> Back down there. Why do I get this gig? People's choice for that last remaining spot. I'm getting too old, man. Oh, it's Tommy. It's Tommy. Look at Bayless. Oh, now, every single time Tommy Sell has gone away like that, there has been no action here whatsoever. Well, I've got to say, Tommy's doing his career on not just being an amazing talent, he's always been a pretty good starter, a very good starter. And he's, oh, Jay Clayton's down at the back. You've got Tommy Sell, the MX1 champ. Conrad News, and I've got to say, Conrad is now starting to get to grips for the really cross in the this final. He's all going to get that bike out of there right now. Look at that. He's spinning up on the floor as well there. That's a dead trick, the dodgy place to be. He's spinning up on the, uh, but that is actually first. Oh, he didn't even let me get on the mic to sell some merch. Oh, 
One night's enough really, isn't it? When, Cheers, what time's this going out? So no. Good man. Well, fucking lovely night. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. We'll catch you tomorrow because there'll be another one. <laughs>